Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy D Lord, and we are here with another episode of our Baltimore Ravens Madden 17 Connected Franchise Series. So we are in week 14. Season is winding down. The Jaguars have the best record in the NFL with a 9-3 record. The Patriots are 9-3 as well. And then the San Diego Chargers are also 9-3. But we're not that far behind. We are 8-4. However, we are in a pretty tough AFC North. We are only one game ahead of the Pittsburgh Steelers, who are 7-5, two games ahead of the Cincinnati Bengals. And we have a pretty comfortable lead over the Cleveland Browns. But we definitely want to get a win here because we're going to be taking on the New England Patriots, who were 9-3. So hopefully, we can get a win here, and that will definitely help our playoff chances, at least trying to make the playoffs into this season. So let's go ahead and jump straight into the commentary. We get the football first. Joe Flacco is coming onto the field. 18 touchdowns, 12 interceptions on the season. Hopefully, we can avoid that interception category in this ball game. But first play from scrimmage, we hand that one off to Justin Forsett. He gets a gain of two on that play. Then on second and eight, we throw to Bashar Perriman. This football will fall incomplete. Third and eight now. We go with a play fake. Joe Flacco's going to roll out to his right. Throw this one down the field, and this football will be incomplete. A defender was able to intercept the ball, but unable to get his feet in bounds. So that will bring on Tom Brady. 25 touchdowns, only five interceptions on the season. So hopefully we can try to control him as best that we can in this matchup. But on their first play from scrimmage, they hand it off to LeGarrette Blunt. He takes that one up the middle for a gain of four. Then on second and six, going with a play fake. Tom Brady taking a shot down the field. He is going to find Julian Elderman who makes that reception, and they are now at midfield. Now it is first and 10. Tom Brady dropping back again. This time he's going to find Martellus Bennett, who makes that reception. Third and five now for the Patriots. Tom Brady with the deep drop back. He's going to throw this one to Amendola, who's able to get both feet down in bounds, and that one will be a reception. So now Laguerre Blunt getting the carry, getting some great blocks down the field. He will take this one to the 11-yard line. So the Patriots are driving down the field pretty good in this um, series, and then they end up capping it off right here with a touchdown pass to the Garrett Blunt. So they do score first. They go up seven to nothing. But on the pursuing kickoff, we're going to have Mike Wallace field this one from about the seven yard line. He's going to cut to the left and the cut back to the right and get a seal block right there. Mike Wallace is off to the races, you guys. Nobody is going to catch him. He's going to take this one to the crib for a touchdown. And we are back trying to tie this game back up. However, on the actual extra point, we will end up shanking this one wide right. So instead of a 7-7 ball game, we are losing by 1.7-6. But here is Tom Brady back on offense, finding Danny Amendola, who breaks out of a tackle right here. And Amendola is off to the races. We're trying to get him with the angle. And eventually, Jimmy Smith will bring him down at the 7-yard line. So now we need to come up with a goal line stand here. Second and goal. This is LeGarrette Blunt taking this one to about the 4-yard line. Now it is third and goal for the New England Patriots. They come out in shotgun formation. This football will fall incomplete. So we're able to stop them. The Patriots will have to settle for a field goal. This kick is up. This kick is good. They are now up by four points. Ten to six is the score. But now we are back on offense. And right away, Joe Flacco will be brought down for a sack. So now it is second and 18. We go ahead and hand this one off to Carlos Williams. And he's going to find a hole. Juke pass a defender. Carlos Williams will pick up a first down on that carry. A gain of 19 for Carlos Williams. So now we are back under center. Second and 10. Joe Flacco will fumble the football. We're able to recover it and get some type of yardage back. But we are still looking at a second and 13. Joe Flacco looking to his left. And this football almost intercepted. Now it is third and 13. Joe Flacco going with a play fake. Rolling out to his right. Taking a shot down the field. Hoping for a miracle. And this football will fall incomplete. Kamar Aiken actually had a pretty good play on the ball. But couldn't reel it in. So now New England is back on offense. Right away. They're going to find Danny Amendola again. Who's able to get a huge block. And this time we are going to be unable to catch him in bounds. So this will be a touchdown for the New England Patriots. And this lead is already kind of ballooning here. 17-6 to is the score. We're now in the second quarter. We kind of need to get some points here on this possession. But Joe Flacco instead will fumble it. And this one will result into a scoop and score. So not only were they winning beforehand, 
now this game is kind of being blown away 24 to 6 is the score but look at that replay getting a huge hit by Dante Hightower then the Patriots are able to come up with that scoop and score and now we definitely need to get something going on offense but right here it is third and eight reliable this one up and this football is intercepted by Devin McCourty so they get the chance to even add on to this already large lead you see Tom Brady on third and nine looking to his right he will find Deion Lewis we're actually able to come up with a stop but they will attempt this long field goal but this one is going to be no good did not have enough power we take over six minutes to go here in the second quarter but then Joe Flacco fumbles the football again we're able to fall on it but now we are looking at a second and 17 Joe Flacco is going to try to find Kamar Aiken on that receiver screen he comes up with the catch but only able to get a couple of yards so now it is third and 12 Joe Flacco sees the pressure throws us one in this football will fall incomplete so we get nothing out of that drive the Patriots are back on offense Tom Brady is going to find Jones who makes that reception and they are back in Baltimore territory third and ten Tom Brady is in shock and getting pretty good protection and eventually he's going to find Martellus Bennett but he fumbles the football on the big hit from CJ Mosley take another look at this one pretty much one-on-one -on -one matchup and CJ Mosley is able to force the football loose. Bennett would get hurt on that play. So that could have contributed to the fumble. But we will take the ball any way we can get it. So right here, Carlos Williams, he gets the handoff, lowers his shoulder, and he will pick up a first down on that carry. Now a couple plays later, it is second to five. We see Perriman on the same route, but he is unable to hold on to the ball. So now it is third to five. Joe Flacco dropping back, looking down the middle. He is going to find Steve Smith, who makes that reception. That's going to keep the drive alive. But now we only have 46 seconds remaining here in the half. And Joe Flacco is able to find Mike Wallace, able to get both feet down in bounds as well. That one will be in reception. Then right here, this is Mike Wallace again on the drag route. He will get enough yards for a first down. So first and 10 from the 10. We basically need to get into the end zone. We get a couple of blocks right here. And Carlos Williams will take this one into the end zone. However, they will rule this one down at the one yard line. So now we're trying to punch this one in. Hand it off to Justin for a set. He goes absolutely nowhere. So now it is third and goal. Trying to get into the end zone. Still looking to our left. Looking for Steve Smith. But this football will fall incomplete. So instead of a touchdown, we have to go ahead and settle for a field goal. This one will be good. And that is going to take us to halftime to the score. 24 2 9. And the New England Patriots, they get the football first to start things off in the second half. So their first play from scrimmage, go ahead and toss this one out to LeGarrette Blunt. He is going to run hard, fall forward, and he will get a gain of about five on that play. Now the second down, the handoff to LeGarrette Blunt again. This time he will get much more than that, a gain of about 11 yards. That's going to be a first down. Now two plays later, the second and five. This is Rob Gronkowski coming up with a first down reception on that play they are back in Baltimore territory first and 10 Tom Brady looking to his left once again fighting Rob Gronkowski on that reception so now it is second and four going with a play fake Tom Brady's looking down the middle but CJ Mosley coming up with a huge interception hopefully we can try to capitalize so we go right back to the ground this is Carlos Williams getting a block down there breaking out of a tackle and then being pushed out of bounds at the 46 yard line so third and two now we go ahead hand it off to Carlos Williams again but this time the Patriots defense is all over that stretch play we will have to go for it on fourth and five this is Joe Flacco dropping back the pressure is coming around the edge Joe Flacco ends up being hit as he tries to throw the football and the Patriots are going to take over in great field position so maybe we shouldn't have went for it on that fourth down but here's the Patriots finding Danny Amendola on that play right there now it is third and three for New England they try to go with a slip screen we're able to take the screen away Tom Brady will throw this one out of bounds and they will come out in punt formation but they decide to go with a fake punt right now but nobody is open because we actually kind of called it a little bit we came out in a punt on um, return man defense so Nothing happens. We get the football now, and we definitely need to try to score. This is going to be Bashar Perriman on that bubble route. He comes up with that six-yard reception. Second and four now. Joe Flacco dropping back, and he will find Kamar Aiken on the drag route, and he will barely be able to pick up a first down on that play. But first down nonetheless. First and ten here. We're going with a play pick again. Finding Kamar Aiken down the field, and that will take us to the 25-yard line, except 
there will be a holding penalty called, and that will bring us back. You see right here, Wendell is going to hold his man, and that will result in the 10-yard penalty. So now it is first and 20. We decided to go with another play fake. Check this one down to our fullback, and look at this. He is going to get a lot of those yards and some right back, taking that one down to the 36-yard line. Now it is second and three. Hand this one off to Carlos Williams. He picks up. A first down on that carry. So now it is first and 10 from the 28-yard line. 35 seconds remaining here in the third quarter. Coming up with that seven-yard reception. Now it is second and three. Joe Flacco is going to find Crockett Gilmore, who makes that reception. That's going to keep the drive alive. Now first and 10. We go with a slip screen. We're going to find Justin Forsett. And Forsett is going to take this one into the end zone for a touchdown. So we're definitely trying to come back. But we're back on the extra point. And look at this one. We are going to shank this one wide left. So the first one was wide right. This one is wide left. We are having issues trying to kick extra points today for whatever reason. So New England is still up by nine points. It was huge because that keeps it a two-possession ball game. And now they're driving down the field trying to make this a three-possession ball game. You see Tom Brady dropping back, taking a shot down the field. But we're able to deflect this football. We actually take over down by nine points. But we got nine minutes to go. But right here, this is going to be Joe Flacco being sacked. By Dante Hightower, look at the move right here. Just pretty much bullying our offensive line. And then coming through with a huge sack. And now, we definitely need to get something going because we are running out of time. We don't have a lot of possession to keep on playing this game. Now it is third down. We need to convert right here. Joe Flacco steps up into the pocket. Checks it down to Brashard Perriman. He tried to lower his shoulder. Unable to do anything. Now it is fourth to three. We have to go for it in this position. We find Kamar Aiken. And Kamar Aiken is going to be ruled short, you guys. You guys be the judge of this one. You see the yard marker right there. It initially looked like he passed it. I don't know. It was definitely close. But we challenged it. We lost the challenge. The Patriots take over at 26 yard loss. We need to play some defense now. You see first and 10 to taking the shot into the end zone. And Eric Weddle had a chance to come up with a huge interception. So now it is third and 10. We are driving back in the zone covered. And Julian Edelman will just sit down in the middle of our zone. Come up with a first down reception. And then the next play, this is going to be Laguerre Blunt hitting the hole. And Laguerre Blunt will take this one into the end zone for a touchdown. So things are not looking good whatsoever. But we're only down by 15 because we stopped the two-point conversion. Now we just need one, uh, two touchdowns and one two-point conversion. And we are back in this ballgame. But you see right here, Carlos Williams taking this one to the right side. He's able to pick up a huge first down on that play. Second and 10 now. Joe Flacco looking for the slip screen. He's going to find Forsett again. And we get a couple of blocks as Forsett is going to finesse his way down to the 25-yard line. Now the very next play, we come out in the empty set. This is Joe Flacco dropping back. And he is going to find Mike Wallace, who was in the end zone again. And this time we have to go with the extra point. Trying to make this an eight-point ball game. This kick is good. And now we need a touchdown and a two-point conversion away from tying this ball game up. But right here, Tom Brady dropping back. Finding Rob Gronkowski. And he is going to take this one into Baltimore territory. A huge play for the New England Patriots right there. Now this is Tom Brady here handing it off to LeGarrette Blunt. He will get a gain of about seven. So now it is third and three for the New England Patriots. Tom Brady dropping back. The pressure is getting to him and we're able to come up with a huge sack right there because now this is a deep field goal. We go ahead and use our final timeout trying to ice him, trying to do whatever we can to make him miss this field goal and it works because he is wide right. So we have the football, 2.48 remaining, a touchdown, a two-point conversion away from tying up this ball game. And right away, we almost found Brashard Perriman, but that football will fall incomplete. So now it is second and 10. We go with the slip screen, but this one loses us seven yards. So now it is third and 17, and we decide to hand it off to Buck Allen. He takes this one to the right side, breaks out of one tackle, and then Buck Allen will be brought down near the 50-yard line. So now it is fourth and 11. We have to go for it at this point. Have no timeouts. We need to come up with the first down. Just throw this one up for Steve Smith, but he actually makes the reception. That was just a prayer throw right there, and he comes through with the catch. Look at this one again. You see Butler in great position, but Steve Smith able to hold on to the football, and we have a chance in this game still, you guys. We have to capitalize. Right here, we find Carlos Williams. He's going to come up with the catch. Juke past the defender, and that will be a first 
down. Now it is the first and ten. Under center, Joe Flacco looking to his left. And that is Steve Smith who makes the reception. And now we are just a two-point conversion away from tying up this game. So we have to go for it. Why not hand it off to Carlos Williams? He breaks out of one tackle, but then the Patriots come through. They're able to come up with a stop. And that is going to be the ball game, you guys. We end up losing this one 30 to 28. Definitely try to rally back, and that is just the two extra points that we missed. Could have been a difference maker because the game would have been tied up at 30 apiece. But instead, we end up taking our fifth loss of the season. We are now 8-5. and five. Patriots are going to advance to 10-3. and three. Joe Flacco had 245 yards through the air, three touchdowns, one interception. Carlos Williams had another great game on the ground, 11 carries, 76 yards, and a touchdown. And then Steve Smith came through with that huge catch at the end, but all of it was not good enough. We ended up losing this ball game. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We are still fighting for the playoff spot. We are still in the league. Hopefully, we can pull this thing out. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead, leave this video a like. It helps me out a lot. And subscribe if you haven't already. It's your boy, D. Lloyd. I'm going to see you all next time. Peace.